Good deed. Two, three, number one. I intend to help myself to positive men. Can't do a voice. Thank you. Number two. I intend to help self-discipline. Can't do a voice. Number three. I intend to use the strength class to check the game so I'm not myself and I'm going to and never be sure or offended. Scherzee! And ten years later, 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 ten All the way down, down the side, the steps of the map, the tree back up. And it crunches, it crunches, and it still burns. I don't want to burn. Let's go, first, first. Let's go, first, first. Let's go, first, first. Get up, back up. Get up. All right, and now right from here going through top is two pound basic. You're just going to do pound one of pound is two pound basic. So you're going to jab, show four jab, and then twist your stance. Jab, show four jab, twist your stance. On your own, please. Good work. Jab, shuffle, four jab, and then switch. Jab, shuffle, four jab, and then switch. Remember, you're trying to get the timing of that front hand and the front foot moving at the same time. Hold your ground and then cover your ground. Hold your ground, cover ground. And now with the jab cross, jab cross, shuffle, four jab cross, and then switch your stance. Good work. Cross, shuffle, jab cross. Remember, get that back shoulder become the front shoulder. Rotate your shoulders when you start your cross. Chin stays in tight. Hold the ground, hit one, two, move forward, one, two, and then switch. And it's time. All right, so now from your front kick. So you're going to go back right front kick, and then slide up front kick, and then you're going to switch the stance and go on the other side. Back right front kick comes first, and then slide up kick the other front kick, and then switch the other side. Good work. Thank you. Back leg, slide up front kick. Switch the stance. Back leg, slide up front kick. Switch the stance. And time, right from here, we'll 10 toes for neutral guard. And now you're just alternating front kick, right leg, left leg on your own. So you're just right leg, front kick, left leg, front kick. And now same thing with side kick. So all ten toes forward, you're kicking to the side, right leg side kick, left leg side kick. I know, good work. Okay.
Now say drill with roundhouse kicks. Go, roundhouse. <laughs> <laughs> and now foot kick roundhouse kick, same thing. So remember the foot kick, it places something on top of the temporary rotation device. If I hit it with the roundhouse kick, I hit with the top of the foot. Foot kick, I clock and I hit with the bottom of the foot. So now foot kick roundhouse is going to go here and then come back over the top. So on your own, foot kick roundhouse kick side to side. And time now, eight count kicking. Neutral stand, position. Yeah. Hands are up by your cheeks. Start with the right leg front kick. Ready? One. Yeah. Left leg, two. Yeah. Side kick, three. Yeah. Four. Yeah. Roundhouse kicks, five. Yeah. Six. Yeah. Neutral kick, roundhouse, seven. Yeah. Yeah. Eight. Yeah. And then straight back to position. And hands up. So again, with the Zoom team, remember purple, blue, green belt. This is what you need for your right tip. This is current curriculum. Eight count kicking again. Hands are up. Starts with the right leg front kicks. Ready? One. Yeah. Left leg. Two. Yeah. Side kicks. Three. Yeah. And then four. Yeah. Roundhouse kicks. Five. Yeah. Six. Yeah. Hook kick roundhouse. Seven. Yeah. Round. Yeah. Eight. Yeah. Round. Yeah. Yeah. Position. One more round. Hands are up. Ready? One. Yeah. Two. Yeah. Three. Yeah. Four. Yeah. Five. Yeah. Six. Seven, two, eight, two, eight, 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 Ready, position. Yeah. Guys, up ready. Yeah. So count one with back leg right front kick. Do that with me. Back leg right front kick. And then downward block, hard blow punch, nice hand block. And then right back to guard. And block through again. Back leg right front kick, downward block, hard blow punch, nice hand block. And do it again. Back to guard, back leg right front kick, downward block, hard blow punch, nice hand block. And do it a couple of times without me now. Back leg right front kick, downward block, hard blow punch. Nice hand block. And one more time. Back to ready stand. And back leg front kick. Downward block. Cardinal punch. Nice hand block. And then back to ready stand. So perform that section now. Ready? Go. Back to guard. Do it again. Go. Back to guard. And go. Back to guard. Two more times. Go. Back with the right shoulder, spinning hook kick with the right, and then I'm right back. 
my job. Don't even worry about adding the front end. Just get the forward again. So back leg, my back, spin the hook to the right, and then right back to the right. 800 times. Go to it. <laughs> Good. I was looking for a cut. Yeah. Yeah. And then if I went to that, I would get it. He did very well. He did. 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 He Spin your kick, and then from the left side, as you slide back and going into the front. Go to chamber and block, and punch, and chamber, and punch, and chamber, and punch, and chamber, and punch. Right, and up on your right hand block. Ready, back leg, right kick. Spin your kick, and then punch from the side. And then back to your right hand block, and back leg, right kick. Spin your kick, punch from the side. Back your right hand block and front kick. Spin your kick. Punch from your ribs. And back your right hand block before it now. Ready? Go! Yeah. Yeah. Ah. And remember it comes from this side, not underneath. Like you did, it's a hammer kick. But the punch really has to come from the feet. Ready? Right hand block and go! Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Right hand block again. Ready? Go! Yeah. 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 Ah. And switch your seats, ready? Ah. Okay, same going on this side, just through the kick. So I go back, left, front kick, climb back, spin your hook kick with the left, and then I'm back to my right hand. On your own, please, go to work! Yes, sir. All right, so now we have the hand. So after you come off of the spinning hook kick, I punch from my right wrist kick, right? So everybody, nice hand left, and front kick. My back spinning hook kick. And now the right side is where the punch comes from. Chamber on the right, and punch. And chamber, punch. And chamber, and punch. So from your right hand block, ready, back by front kick. Spinning hook kick, and punch. And again, from your right hand block, back by front kick. Spinning hook kick, and punch. Back your right hand block one more time. Back by front kick, spinning hook kick, and punch. Good, and relax. So that's advanced to sound basics. Of course, it would be one and then two, and then we would switch you over to the other side. We'll put the two of them together next week. So now we're jumping into katas. Short one kata. Make sure you pay attention to your surroundings. There's targets, there's couple air filtration devices, there's people, a couple of phones, and even that. <laughs> Ready? Position! Yeah. Short one kata performance page. Sorry, sorry. Short one. Short one.
And one, step back, flat, watch block. Two, step back, block, keep. That chance goes off shoulder, outward block, punch. Step backwards, outward block, keep. That chance goes off shoulder, outward block, punch. Step backwards, upward block, keep. That chance goes right shoulder, downward block, punch. Step backwards, downward block, keep. And then that chance goes right shoulder, step around the horse stance. And then finish it off. And then set. And curtsy. All right, so let's perform that one a couple of times. Neutral stance, position. Yes. Mr. Burton. Yeah. And everyone can see you. I'll let you be patient again. You're doing more. Yes, sir. Product. 
Push, push, push. Step roundhouse kicks. Take a couple of deep breaths. So now the switch step roundhouse is a hit the target. Shin is still in, of course, right? No reason for me not hitting my shin. So I switch my feet. And remember the switch step instead of forward and back feet. I want to think more side to side and shallow. And then I hit that lead leg and then right back to my guard. So it's like side to side, lead leg, back to my guard. Make sense? Okay. And left side forward for the first minute. Go to work. Shadow side to side, I think that's even 
All right, so now next combination is two roundhouse kicks. Oh, she's a third kick. We might have been third kick. So here's what's going to happen. My first one is the switch step roundhouse kick. Right off of that, I step and I go right to my back leg roundhouse kick. And then right off that, I go back to my lead leg roundhouse kick. If I have the flexibility to go to the head, the third one goes to the head. So I'm going from here and I'm switching and I'm hitting the leg. And I'm coming right up to the body. And then I would be going right up to the head. Right? So if you visualize it on that, for instance, you did a 30 kick, then I'm here and I'm hitting the leg, and I'm coming right to the body, and then right after that, I'd be going right to the head. Right? And you can shin in that top of my foot like that. So it's going to be in the two feet. Are we good? Yes, sir. So switch step round, body kick back leg round, lead leg to whatever your flexibility will allow you to do. Work it from whichever side you would like to. I'm just going to give you this.
it's great to just yell at somebody for the problem and make it feel like you're the problem as opposed to the problem itself. Right? And so it's important that anytime we have a dispute with somebody, we try to make sure that we think about how can we make sure they understand that it's not them, but the behavior that we need to see. Right? Um, and this is something that is parents or certainly kids, if you're ever getting redirected at home, right? You should all get redirected. The simplest way to say that is if you ever get in trouble at home, of course the answer is yes, right? We all get in trouble. I still get in trouble. Right? And the key though is to understand that when your parent or whoever it happens to be is yelling at you, they're really not yelling at you, they're yelling at the problem, right? They may not understand how to bring this across, but it's not you that they don't know. It's the behavior that they don't know, right? Now the challenge with separating these is our behaviors are so tied into who we are that sometimes we think that we are our behaviors, right? But we're not. The perfect example of this is if I were to say not be related to the class, you know, or even if I were to do anything not, we have this behavior that I'm going to work at home. It's not going to make the class, right? And I know you can be better if you change that behavior, right? So instead of being late for class, we're going to be in the time for class. Well, that's just why I'm always like, right? he's deciding to always be there, right? We are not like people who you decide to have that about. We have to change things, right? So we're associated with the problem. We're associating who we are with what that behavior is. And instead of associating with what we should, we want to disassociate the problem, disassociate any behavior from the problem. And instead, you know, say, well, here's what I am, and I can choose to see this behavior. Right? So instead of associating, well, that's just who I am. And Seth said, huh, which is an interesting thought. You know, that's how we would be in the future. Interesting thought. We link, not me. We think of our group. We link, right? You're, we're disciplined differently. Now, are we all going to be late sometime for something, somewhere, somehow, because of something? Yeah, of course. Right? But the reality is, is it's a habit. Right? You're either typically on time or typically late. Right? So, this is the detail of our life. So, it's focusing on the challenge of. Problem versus solution. Focus on the problem and behavior versus the person themselves. If you're having to have a discussion with somebody. And secondly, if the person is having a discussion with you, understand that they're really talking about the behavior and that's really the issue. They may not be good at explaining that, they may be terrible at explaining that, and then they kill you but they're attacking you directly. But what they're really trying to do, they're just bad at it, is correct the behavior. So there you go. Don't take it so personally. Relaxing, not in front of anything dedicated to the martial arts. I will live a principal life. I will live a principal life. Modesty, courtesy, integrity, self control, perseverance, and indomitable spirit. What is cool? Position, yes. Courtesy, oh, in that martial arts. Awesome, nice job, team. High five. Nice work, Zoom team! See ya!